Hey, look, check me out. Pulled up right here. I'm coming off the real shit. I pulled up, you good? My nigga, real shit. This is my nigga, real shit. I miss my nigga. It's been so long since I've seen my nigga. I swear, I miss my nigga. It's crazy, bro. I'm going fucking. You know what I'm saying? Gone and shit. Crazy, bro. I should be fucking me up. I swear, that shit been hurt. Crazy, bro. I hate how I was like I didn't know how that shit be before. Nigga really hurt. Going through shit. Lost my nigga. Lost my dog. You know what I'm saying? That shit be motherfucking fuck with me. You know what I'm saying? How you just lose somebody and you just grow up with one of them. That shit be crazy. 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 Losing that nigga, that shit turned me into a straight man, bro. I swear that shit fucked me up. That shit turned me into a man. I learned a valuable lesson from that nigga. And I just know never to give up, never to do nothing. Crazy. Never commit suicide. None of that shit, you feel me? If it wasn't for my nigga, we wouldn't be in this bitch right here. That shit made me way stronger. That shit made me way smarter. That shit made me way more calm. How we react to everything. I know what's up, you feel me? Now I know what to do. I know I got a purpose out here. I know there's a reason for why I'm out here and why I'm doing what I'm doing. Mm-hmm. So I'm gonna just stay strong, even though like this shit is hard to stay strong. I'm gonna just do that shit. You feel me? If I don't do that shit, ain't nobody gonna do that. You feel me? More and more of that shit. So if I give up, guess what's gonna happen? Nothing. But if I continue going and continue living life out here, nigga, then guess what will happen? A nigga will still continue to flourish. A nigga, a nigga will still continue to be great. You know what I'm saying? A nigga will still continue to be great, no matter what. And that's what I'm striving to do. I'm striving to continue to be great. If it wasn't that situation that happened, I swear I probably would have been more great. Yeah, like I was saying, yeah, that situation made me be way more grateful. You feel me? It made me take life serious. It made me actually appreciate what I got out here. It made me want to work even harder and work even smarter too. You feel me? It made me realize, like, hey, I probably ain't even got that much time here on the earth because it could be my time any moment. You feel me? Just like how it was my nigga time. It could be my time any moment, and I know that shit. I just know it. They just made me want to go harder. It made me more grateful. It made me like, like care about life more. It made me want to do more. You feel me? It made me want to fucking like work, get a whole lot of shit done. It made me even like be smarter too. It made me even think like, oh, I shouldn't even spend these spending time in places where I could probably get hurt, killed, you know, what I mean? injured, all kinds of shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Like because that shit was all over the news. That shit humbled me. That shit made me actually like. You know what I'm saying? Like, wanna actually like live longer. I swear. Like, you know what I'm saying? Before that situation, I was kind of living reckless. I swear. I was kind of like, you know what I'm saying? Just being around, hanging out, and all that shit with like people I shouldn't even be hanging out with for real. But when that shit happened, that shit made me tighten up. You know? That shit even made me like secure myself even more by being quiet. You know what I'm saying? Because you don't really gotta let everybody know what you're doing. What you doing. What you on and all that shit. Where you be at and all that shit. You feel me? That shit fucked me up, bro. That shit hurt me. That shit put tears in my eyes, bro. Because that nigga meant a lot to me, you know, me, but a whole lot of people in this area, too. You feel me? That shit killed me, bro. That shit made me sick. That shit made me vomit. I couldn't even sleep properly. I couldn't eat properly. You feel me? I just can't think about that nigga. Heaps and heaps and heaps and heaps and heaps all the way till I actually went crazy, bro. I swear, it's crazy how I actually went crazy, like, doing this shit, bro. you know what I'm saying? Like, throughout this shit, during this shit, it turned me crazy, it turned me into an animal. Maybe not even give a fuck about nobody, maybe not even give a fuck about myself. But it also, you know what I mean? Like, it made me not really care about myself, maybe look at myself, like, yeah, like, fuck me, you know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't shit. 
You know what I mean? Like, I really ain't shit. If that nigga died, like, what about me? You know what I mean? That nigga lost his life. What about me? I did a whole bunch of fuck shit in my life. I remember me and him used to pick it together. We used to spend time together. We used to smoke together. We used to drink together. We used to get lit together. We used to get drunk together. We used to do all kinds of shit. We used to travel together, do activities together. You know what I'm saying? Drive together, hang out together, do all kinds of shit. So when that shit happened, that shit actually hurt me. You know what I mean? We used to spend time at his house. I know his whole family. You know? His family knows my family. Fuck me up. I'm heartbroken. You feel me? Like, this heart will never be the same. And just being here at this place right here is really just hurting me. It's killing me, bro. Fuck. It's fucked how I just gotta deal with it. I can't do shit about it. I just gotta live. And the only way I'm going is up. You feel me? I'm gonna keep making content. I'm gonna keep. As he chasing my dreams and living my dreams for him, you feel me? Long live that nigga, you feel me? Long live my nigga, you feel me? Rest in peace in my nigga, you feel me? I'm gonna see you in heaven, bro, you feel me? That's it, that's It's a little three-pack, you dig? Patron tequila gift pack. With the Patron Silver Tequila, 200 milliliters, and the Patron Reposado Tequila, 200 milliliters, and the Patron, I'm, I don't know if I'm about to say it right, but it's the Patron, I mean, I think it's the Patron Anejo Tequila, 200 milliliters, or Aneo. Yeah, I think that's what it is, to be honest. That sounds more like what it is. An Aneo, I swear. Aneo sounds like what it is, but this is what it look like, you feel me? So, yeah, you can see the bottle like that. The flash is in the way type shit. Mm -hmm. As for what it came in, like, yeah, bro. It came in this shit right here. Tanks right there too. Dude. Hey, this is where I'm at right now. You dig? Out here for the thighs and shit. And this cloud water. Look under here. Y'all see this? Got some shit right here too. You feel me? The towel right there, the time bell towel. Oh look, I didn't even realized that shit. They got a ball up there. I could really look kinda like a map kinda. But it ain't. And they got problems up there too. Oh whatever that shit is. You know, the bells over that shit. Comic Dex. What up? Yeah. <laughs> 